Getting started it can truly be the hardest part, but when done right, it's impossible not to have a great time. It's not the goal to overdo it, rather to anticipate movements later to come during exercise. Three to five minutes can be a great baseline. A better scale would be your feeling of readiness. The movements started with here are a split jump and a jumping jack, followed by six exercises that done consistently with scaled progression will help you to significantly gain strength. Ah, uh, the setup. It requires a tight squeeze to get to the top position and a controlled release all the way to the bottom. Is it bad for you? Is the setup bad for your spine? Let me know your opinion in the comments below. Regardless, priming the core is essential on a chest day, helping to create stability, which will benefit your chest flies really tearing up slower acting muscle fibers and allowing tons of blood flow. Following the chest flies up with a heavier load on a bench press, or in this case a floor press, will really help break down the faster acting fibers in the chest. Is it more beneficial to do all of your sets for each exercise back to back? Or select two exercises that compound and complement each other and alternate between them? Well, it's in this case that I prefer to alternate. It allows for me to complete the floor exercises together rather than needing to return from standing to the floor multiple times. The skull crusher is a formation of a tricep extension which ensures the stability of your scapula. In this case, adding a massive stretch to your triceps. Not every exercise is for everyone, so play around with different angles to see what works best for you. A chest press has been completed in this exercise already, making this banded press a sure way to finish up your pectoral training with this variation of load, angle, and increased range of motion by freeing the scapula up from the floor. A single arm tricep extension will fit perfectly here, allowing the use of generated core and scapula stability to enhance the ability to find a peak contraction with every extension, efficiently controlling the stretch and release. If you got to the end of this video, I'd like to thank you for your support and not only recommend for you to destroy that like button to help with my channel's growth, but subscribe and check out the pull and leg day video that will finish up this mini series of the three day workout routine. As always, eat your food, invest your time, and take care, fellow gainers.